have to cut a path each time it snows real bad to get back to my farm birds in the backyard here so we'll just walk along the uh the drifts here alongside the barn so you guys can see them they're pretty hungry i feed them real heavy the day before it snows and then when the snow's coming down on them, I have to let, let them go. And then once the snow stops, like today, then I can get back here and feed them. Now it looks like uh, the drift here is about, I'm going to say about 17, between 17 and 18 inches. It's, uh, this is the high one that's alongside of my barn. But on average probably, I'm going to, I'm thinking like, this looks like an average area out here. So we'll take a quick measurement out here after I just got done cutting the path. We'll just go right here, it looks okay. It looks like we're at about, on average, about 13 inches, uh, most likely, because it, when I look out here, this is about one area in my yard that's uh, pretty much no obstructions blocking anything to cause wind buildup turbulence. So I'm going to just do one more quick test. Between 12 and 13 inches, I'm going to say. That looks like what we got out here where I live. Well, this is just about going to do it for our episode on the giant big storm that hit Leonard, Michigan, February 2nd, 2011. So anyway, we got the driveway all cleared up and I got my pad done in front of the, the garage and that's just about gonna do it. So I hope you guys stay tuned in for our upcoming episodes. Until next time, this is 3-1 Pockets and thanks for watching.